Hey, what's up? This your boy, Big Man. You already know what it is, man. So let's get right to it. Okay, so this is an interesting story, man. Now, I, I might even have to call it a rumor. But there is a report that matches up with a lot of the information that's floating around social media right now. Now, there was a viral star or a, viral, a dude who went viral. And everybody called them, I got time to date cuts kid, man. Now, this dude basically went viral for banging on somebody else. And it was caught on tape. Basically, in the whole situation, it looked like he had gotten to an altercation with a guy the day before. And then he ended up, you know, calling out the dude or whatnot. And it was a viral meme or whatever. And it just went around and around to the point where other rappers were commenting on it and things like that. But, man, some crazy news happened today to dude, man. They're saying he actually passed away and was and was the victim of a, of a senseless shooting death, man. Now, there's a report to match this, you know, in, in his name and whatnot. Allegedly, his name is Vincent Brown. Now, his family or nobody like that has come out to speak, but there definitely is a report from Colorado. And when I say Colorado, I'm not talking about the other place. I'm talking about Aurora, which is close to there. It's in Denver as well. But man, it's a sad situation altogether. Now, before we get into the specifics, do me a favor. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. And man, let's get it. Okay, now that we got that out of the way, let's talk about this story, about this viral star, and man, it ends in tragedy. Okay, man, now it's crazy how these things just become a part of, you know, social media, become a part of society, and how a viral clip can spiral out of control, and next thing you know, it just becomes a catchphrase, a saying, people at work know, at regular work, who work, excuse me, regular jobs know about it. It's just one of those viral things that people laugh at. And don't even think about, man. I mean, people do wonder what happens to these viral stars and people from these little clips, especially from the early days of YouTube and Vine and things like that. But, you know, they kind of take on their own life and live by themselves. And we hardly ever think about the person. Now, the person in this case is allegedly a gentleman by the name of Vincent Brown. Now, a lot of people are referring to him as the, to, the today I got time today cuz kid. And man, that's a lot to say, but man, that's easier than saying the kid who went viral if for banging on somebody in the clip. You know what I mean? So the today I got time because kid or Vincent Brown, allegedly, you know what I'm saying? Dude, man, ran into a, a situation up there in Colorado and it looks all bad, man. It seems like Colorado is a spot you don't want to be in at no time right now, man. It looks like there's a lot going down there as far as, you know what I'm saying, tragedy right. And this is just adding on to it. Now, it seems like he was living in Aurora, Colorado, and that's where tragedy struck. Now, let's look at the exact news report. Now, in this news report, the title of the report, it says, Aurora Police Investigate Suspicious Death Outside a Tire Shop. Now, in this separate report, they actually go into more detail. They say, 22-year-old man found shot today, uh, excuse me, found shot to death outside Aurora Tire Shop. So we're going to read that one. Now, in this report, it says these things. It says, officers are investigating the shooting death of a man found outside an Aurora tire shop on Sunday morning, according to Aurora Police Department, APD. APD said they arrived at Front Range Tire at 3000 South Peoria Street at 10 a.m. Sunday. Police said the man had suffered obvious trauma, but not give any more specifics. The Arapo County Coroner's Office said 22-year-old Vincent Brown was the victim. And at this point, you know, everybody is saying that's the uh, today I got time because kid, man. And to be honest, he's not a kid, man. He's a man. He's a grown man, 22 years old, who tragically lost his life. Now, this is all rumor, man. Nobody has come forward from his family or anything to say, yes, this is the same person or yet yeah, or besides different online hip hop news sources and stuff like that, man. But either way, it's a sad situation, man. And it looked like, man, there was a, the video that went viral, right? But then there was another video that went viral who showed him later at life. And it looked like he was on that same time, to be honest with you, man. Because the kid in the video, you could say, okay, man, he's a kid. He's being foolish. The funny part about it is, you know, he looks harmless when he's saying all this. But he's saying it with such bravado and such, you know, feeling that you think that you know that he really feels that he's that tough in the video. 
And then when they caught up with him later on in life, it was like in a coffee shop or something like that. He was on that same time, man. He was he was really on that, man. And it's funny that what he said in that video, I even used it just now, man. It's, I'm on that time today because, you know, it's it just became a catchphrase and things that, that something that went viral and caught on in pop culture. So that's why it's not kind of weird to do this story, even though I talk about rappers most of the time. But like I said, it's hard for us to understand at, at the time that these are actual people and they got, a, they got a life that they're living. And man, things don't always go in a positive direction for them after these clips go viral, especially when it comes to like a lot of these videos where people are caught out there bad or doing bad and something crazy is going on, man. Like after those videos, I'm pretty sure there's a detrimental effect on the person's, person's long term, you know what I'm saying? stability in society or even in their local community because these things live on the internet forever and forever this guy is going to be known as the i got time today cuz kid even if he passed away or not now everybody especially other hip-hop news organizations and stuff are reporting that this is actual factual dude did pass away he is vincent brown but if not, man, it's still a sad situation to say the least. Now, what's even more interesting is how Trippy Red, you know, made this go even more viral back in 2017 when he added the snippet to one of his uh, songs or whatever, his mixtape or whatnot. And I wonder what his opinion about the situation because he did kind of profit off the meme. So I don't know, man. He probably doesn't have any feeling or feel any way about it. But it seems like dude was already on a weird path and man, Hopefully, this didn't make it even worse for him. Now, there's a lot of debate about what his real name is, if he's Vincent Brown, if he's Timothy Brown, if the Vincent Brown in this story is the exact same kid that was found, you know, shot and killed in that uh, outside of the tire shop. But either way, whoever lost their life, man, it's uh, rest in peace to them. And, you know, a sad situation. Now, to be honest, man, I want to know, man, how you guys feel about this, man? What do you think about these viral memes and these hit viral sensations? I mean, to be real, these things go viral and I don't think these people even get paid off of it. You know what I mean? Like they don't get any type of compensation for anything like this. So they could definitely have a negative impact on somebody's life. Now, I'm not blaming the clip or the viral meme on him going down the wrong path or what happened to him in Colorado, allegedly. But I'm just saying what... Isn't it a weird path that these things seem to go on? But like I said, man, until anything comes out or the person's family comes out and confirms this, this is all rumor. But it's an interesting story to say the least. And man, rest in peace to whoever that gentleman is, Vincent Brown, who lost his life. Now with that, this has been your boy, Big Man. Please hit that like button. Please hit that subscribe button. And make sure you hit that notification bell so that way you get a notification every time I drop this hot content. And we out of here. Oh yeah, and if you made it to this part of the video, make sure you click that like button.